Hi everybody, have you missed me? No, I thought not. I thought I'd do an explanation video. It's been at least two, maybe even three weeks since I did the last upload. Uh, I've been doing extra duties at work. Uh, I've been trying to do two people's jobs. Uh, so that's been taking a lot of time up. Not only that, the weather's turning. And uh, when you go in at night, I don't know if it's just me, but you know, you, you bank that log burner up get sat in a nice comfortable chair and you don't really want to come outside if it's cold could just be me I don't know so I've got all that plus my son has been sorting out the new old workshop uh, which we're going to put a new roof on in a couple of weeks so there's all that to do uh, do some stickers and one or two other things so we'll start with the workshop this is the outside of the front of the workshop it used to be covered in compost bins so he's cleaned all the compost up and jet washed it all, made quite a good job. And if you remember from the last time I filmed in here, it was all full of racks and uh, wood and other junk. So he's cleaned the majority of that out, he's took the few, few benches out that were in here. The floor is on a bit of a slope. So to level it out we have to re-concrete it all. And there's the pit that you couldn't really see in the last video. Uh, we took the boards off, or my son did, and it, again it was full of water. So we've just decided just to fill it in, and concrete on the top, get rid of it. It certainly did bring back a few memories. I've spent countless hours down there. The majority of the brickwork is still in pretty good condition, uh, apart from on the window side wall, whoever built the wall originally, I believe it's been up about 100 years, uh, just followed the contour of the ground. As you can see, I put the windows in about 15 years ago, uh, the windows actually level, so it shows you how far the brickwork's off. We're still solid. So here we are. He's cleaned all this out, bless him. You can see it's uh, lots of bit of work. So the next job uh, in, I've, I've got a week off at the end of October, so we're going to put a new roof on it. Uh, sort the walls out. Sort these windows out. And uh, put a new floor in. Because you've seen the pit down there, look. If I can... There it is, look. Uh, so just to fill pit in, it keeps filling it with water anyway, it always has done. Every time I wanted to use it in pass, we just have to bail it out first. So, uh, that's all to come. Now, I know some of you will be wondering where's all that wood gone? Ah, uh, well, at this time of year, we don't use the big greenhouse. To be honest, we haven't used it much over the past two years anyway. So, I'll take you through to the big greenhouse. So until we can get the old new workshop uh, watertight and somewhat like secure, it looks like this is going to be the new woodshed for a while. He's not only filled the big greenhouse, he's also filled the polytunnel.
So that's the new old workshop. Uh, it's going to go a new roof. I say I'm, I've got a week's holiday at the end of October. Uh, so the new roof's going to go on then. Uh, maybe with some new floor. Uh, we're going to do a floor in stages, re concrete it all, uh, insulate it so it's going to make a nice workspace. Uh, my son's plan is to start recycling old furniture, building furniture, things like that. Recycling old items, upcycling, that type of thing. Uh, it may involve me, you may not, you can never tell. Uh, as for in this workshop, I haven't had much time to do anything. I were hoping to have my dust extraction in by now, but I've been doing that many hours at work. It's just been an impossibility. So that will be up and coming. I can't guarantee a video for next week, uh, but the following week I should be back. I'm back during my normal hours, so the following week I should be back to normal. So hopefully after that, it should be a video pretty much every week after that. Now onto the stickers. I've only got one to hand, so I'll just mention him. Uh, SK Crafts sent me this the other week. Uh, it's pretty much like me. Uh, no frills, tells it as it is. Uh, seems to be a great guy. So uh, I'll leave a link in the description. Go and check him out. What else is there? Oh, my missus wants a bathroom remodeling uh, in the house. Uh, we've got this downstairs bathroom, I always class it as like a, a working men's bathroom. It's never been updated in the last 20 years. It is a bit of a state to be honest. Uh, and she wants it redoing. Is that something that you would like to see on this channel? Uh, I would love to know. I'm just always scared of mixing things up. Uh, that's why I keep me Sharpie's garage car repair separate to Sharpie's workshop. Uh, if you think it would fit in doing remodeling a bathroom on this channel let me know uh, I'd love to know what your opinion is and uh, if it did interest anybody and if it does I'll film it and pop that on as well well I have just uploaded a video to uh, my other channel Sharpie's Garage uh, my sister-in-law has built a bit of a camper van type thing weekend van uh, if that interests anybody I'll put a link into the description for that that's about it for this one so if you like subscribe Thanks for sticking with me. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.